Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Train Lab. And it's on a lab coat, so you know it's legit. So, you know, Train Lab is where I do experiments on trains or ask questions like, can this be done or is this possible? So, in this episode, we're going to talk about the Uni Pacific Big Boy Steam Engine. As you may recall, a couple years ago, it was running out west after Uni Pacific restored it. And everybody had big boy fever. Manufacturers kept making big boys and HO on all different scales. And they were really pricey. And honestly, I don't want to spend the money on one of those. But I really want a big boy. Now I have an Allegheny, which, you know, is almost the same size. But the Allegheny is probably more powerful and way cooler. But let's not debate that. So, how am I going to get a big boy? Then it hit me. What if I built one from scratch, from materials I have around me, leftover train parts from other things I've done, and anything I can get my hands on around the house to actually build an HO big boy? Now, to do this, you have to do a lot of research online, look at diagrams, that's what you want to do for starters. Uh, big boy, let's see. Built between 1941 and 1944 by the American Locomotive Company. 25 are made. Let's see. 132 feet and 9 and a quarter inches long. Wow. 11 feet wide. Wow. Then you want to get together all the parts and bits and pieces that you get your hands on before you start building. We got your styrene stock, all kinds of shapes, brass wire, all sorts of parts. They can be modified. Metal parts, plastic parts, brass stock, screws. And then it's time for assembly. There's a lot of cutting, grinding, filing, whatever, forming the boiler, all that stuff. Ladies and gentlemen, after months and months of research, gathering parts, and working many nights without any sleep, I finally finish the big boy. So without any further ado, I present my scratch-built big boy. <laughs> <laughs> 